We are back with more science fun with Mr. C. Okay, so we're going to uh, stick with the dry eyes theme. Yeah, we're going to do some more dry eyes fun. Okay, that's always fun. Let's go ahead and dive right into it. All right, so what we have here is plastic cup at home. You grab one of these, you cut a little hole in the bottom of it, and then you get a balloon, and you just basically cap off the other side. And so I can <laughs> get a little air going at you, right? <laughs> but yeah. it, wouldn't it be a lot more fun if we could actually see what the air was doing? Yeah. Yeah. That's what you're here yeah, for. That's exactly it. why I'm let's here for. It. So what we're going to do is we're going to throw a piece of dry ice in here. We're going to throw a piece of dry ice in yours. And just to reiterate one more time, if you're just now joining us, obviously you, you're a professional. You know, you know what you're doing. Um, you don't want to just touch dry ice. That's why you have the gloves here. Absolutely. So this is great learning fun that you can do at home with your family. Yes. But it's really important that when you're working with this, that you're not holding it and touching with your bare hands because it's so cold. Um, so it sublimates and it goes really quickly. But we don't want to hurt ourselves, so go ahead and hold it up. I have some warm water here, and basically what we're doing is we're creating some smoke inside of our little container. Yeah. Let's do a little bit more. And then this, you saw it on the teaser earlier, right? Oh yeah, with the we big saw trash the can. the big trash can, so here we have the little one. There we go. Oh. And if you're a little gentle, you got the little, little itty bitty vortex cannon. So you can have a little warp. How are you getting the circles coming out? Mine's so like nice, terrible. Nice, nice and, nice and. I have a circle. Look at that. It up. Sally's got it. Oh, there you go. Oh, look at it. Oh, look at that was a Those good one. Those are beautiful smoke rings. Look at that. If we can get one going right to the camera, Here. maybe sideways. There we go. Oh, that is so cool. So this is a lot of fun that you can have at your house. And if the reaction starts slowing down, you grab yourself another piece of dry ice. You pop it in. Doop, doop. She's like, I need more dry ice, Mr. C. Give me more, Here. Mr. C. And when the reaction st starts slowing down, you grab a little bit more water. And there we go. I can How make the perfect fun is that? That is fun. So this is something you can do at home. You can grab the dry ice. Dry ice is sold at Meyer locally. They sell it in um, big chunks. I pick mine up at Weiler Welding. They sell little pellets, which are nice because you can plop them right in. But the cool thing about dry ice is the fact that this is this that <laughs> ring was yeah. amazing. I was, trying to shoot, I was trying to shoot another ring through it. Ma'am. So what's really cool about this fun. is that you can build these at home, and it's so easy, right? Yeah. I mean, exploring the world around us is so much fun. The idea that science is everywhere, whether it's in a little vortex cannon, or you can make a big one, and I have a video on my YouTube channel or my website that you can actually go watch and do. Well, Tell us about your channel. So quick. my channel, my YouTube channel, um, I have 100 plus videos, I have songs, math and science songs, and lots of science experiments that I do in my house, and that's pretty much it. Good deal. Well, thanks for stopping by.